everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda BTJ Craft's 5th Quest for Zelda Classic Part 3. Turns out I forgot a heart container over here. I have the raft and the ladder, so now I can grab it. Yay! Brings our total up to 8 heart containers now. Back across the water, now we attempt level 4. Here we go. Yeah, we should be able to knock this one out pretty quick. Four shouldn't take nearly as long as three. So maybe we could get five done, no guarantees, but... We'll see what happens here. Boy, no regular buyers, we're just going right into the tribbles. Alright, gotta walk through the northern wall here after you clear them out. Oh, yep, fire souls are back for more. Well, if you haven't noticed by now, BTJ Craft tends to stick to the, uh... To the same enemies that the first quest had for each level. Because level 4 you usually see fire, zoles, like likes, bubbles. And you're gonna get more of the same here, except they're souped up. So we're having to deal with fire zoles and fire tribbles and that stuff. Yeah, only reason going into that room was for the compass. Now we go this way. Ah, blue like likes. I don't know what the difference is between them and the orange counterparts. And I don't really wish to find out either. Maybe these guys eat money or something, I don't know. I don't know if they're weaker versions of the orange like likes or what, but... Yeah, with our one key, I think... Oh, wait a minute, we gotta do something else here, don't we? Oh, yeah, we have to go south, that's right, gonna bomb this wall here. Was a, oh, I think it was the other room we had to do it. I might be thinking of a different dungeon. Oh, no. I think I gotta go back to the beginning here. Yeah, the bomb the north wall, I think. Or the right. Or the left. Blah. Oh, here we go. This is another key we can grab over here. I would like to hang on to my extra key if I could possibly help it. Now we can also exploit that key glitch over at level 6 too when we get there. So that way I'll end up having two extra keys, which will be nice. Yay, and what's up here? It's a passageway! To what, though? Does it lead to the boss or does it lead to a dungeon item? I is intrigued to find out. Alright, eliminate the fire Zol and his gels. And it's a passageway. And we got fires. I'm surprised he didn't get knocked back. Yeah, I want to kill him, see if he drops anything. Nope. Going down. Oh, we got fires and like likes. Oh yeah, we gotta kill these keys really quick before they morph back the virus again. God damn it. Yeah, you want to be quick in dealing with them. Oh. You almost had me there. He would have manhandled manhandled me. <laughs> Horrible. Yay, the map. Yeah, this dungeon looks kind of similar to the first one, with the, with the letter E gimmick. I think level one had a similar map, if I remember. Come on, Fire Souls, hurry up. Yeah, he's gonna hang out over there, isn't he? Let's snuff him out! Ugh. Yeah, I'm starting to run out of ammo with the arrows here. Come on, fire, go away! Right, let me get him. He's in a 
good spot. Okay, we're going south. Let's see what we got down here. We got key send like likes. Yep, excuse me. <laughs> Get around you. Kind of tight quarters there a little bit. And unlock this door. What do we got? All right, we're getting the dungeon item here. We've got three, four blue limolas. Oh boy! Glad I picked up those extra hearts. Oh god, I used my flame. Wow, and I somehow did not get hit by that limola. That's surprising. Well, you can try to hang out behind the blocks and snipe them. Watch out! These guys do about a heart per hit. Thankfully, the white sword rips right through them quick. Hmm, okay. How to get through these blue flames without... Well... Oh, I used my candle now. I'm just gonna have to take a hit and go through. Thankfully, it only does a half a heart of damage, so it's not that bad. So I tried pushing the blocks and they wouldn't budge. Unless I was pushing them the wrong way, I don't know, but... Ah! Son of a bitch. Okay, there's probably gonna be another key in here. I'm gonna waste all the like likes and fires to get it. Oh. Wasn't too well positioned there. Okay, you get stunned. Haha, -ha, key. Alright, that about oh wait a minute. I think there's something to the south here too, isn't there? Aha! Hidden passageway! You almost tricked me! I'm curious about that one room I missed though. I think it had the magic boomerang back there. Yeah, that's probably what it was. I might have to come back to the dungeon. I think this leads towards the boss. That's okay. If I miss the magic boomerang, I'll come back in and grab it. I'm not worried about it. Blue like likes. Again. Gonna kill them just in case they leave bombs or something else good. As I wanted. Come here. And nothing at all. Blah. And all fires. Come here. No running away. Well, nothing for cleaning up, cleaning all them up. Oh well. Well, a bunch of keys and fires to end the dungeon on. Yeah, I could just go to the boss now, but there's an extra key in to the north here. I want to grab. I'm gonna walk through the wall, I think, or bomb it, I guess. If you can't bomb, walk through. If you can walk through, if you can't walk through, then bomb. Always the easy way of figuring it out. I hope I'm ready for whatever the level 4 boss is. Key! Well, let's see what's in here. Oh god, it's a Patra. Oh god, I really gotta be careful. And he could own me in two more hits. Alright, retreat. Just play this patiently, I can't afford to be reckless. Now go, go. <laughs> 
gotta wait for him to kind of move down a little. Run, retreat. Ooh. Ooh, okay. That played out perfectly. Thank God this Patro doesn't fire beams off. If that was a Patro 2, I would have easily been boned. But yay, level 4 is beat. Haha. -ha. Now we gotta come back and explore that missing room, which has the magic boomerang. I want it. We're going back for it. Wee. Back over here. As I stated before, level 4 wasn't that long. Okay. Let's light things up in here. After killing all the fires. Hello, Magic Boomerang. And now we are ready to leave the dungeon. Could we attempt level 5 and maybe get it done? Mm. It's early enough in the video, I think I could take a risk. Back up, da. Bad spot. Alright, that'll do it for this dungeon. Wee. So yeah, Patra in level 4. Really? But hey, we're at 9 hearts now. Alright, what's next on the agenda here? I think I'll try to slam five out. We got plenty of. We still got some, a lot of extra time to kill, and I'm gonna go for it. Hmm. Where is five again? Oh, right. I, I know where it is. Wait, I gotta go back. What am I doing? Yeah, it's back in this forest area over here. Gotta go south a couple screens. And if I remember correctly, I think there's another heart container here on this screen. Gonna burn one of the bushes here. I think it's probably gonna be right about here. Yep. Take any one you want. Yay, our count goes up to ten. Buffing up that life meter. I think after five, we're gonna hunt for the blue map because... Yeah, Wizrobe Hell in level 6, as always. So yeah, level 5, where level 8 used to be in the first quest. Here we go, level 5. Yeah, we got Gibdos. The regular Gibdos, and we got Fire Souls. Yeah, this fifth quest is going by pretty fast. Uh, let me see. Do we have a bomb up here? Let me see. Nope. All right, we're going right. And blue dark nuts are back. Surprise, surprise. They were in the original level five also. They're kind of expected by this point. Level 3 we could have done without him, however, but hey. I don't mind the extra challenge. Like I said, if you're a master of the sideways sword track, this will be easy. These blue dark knots aren't going to give you much trouble at all. Alright, I think we got a bomb. Yeah, we got I was thinking this room we had the bomb to itself. Yeah, here we go. I don't know why I thought it was like that in 4. Hey, stop. Whoa. Hey, wait. Fires weren't in the original level 5. What are they doing here? 
And I remember them being in 4, 6, and 9. They were never in 5. Well, the second quest they were, but... Not the first one. Yeah, Fire Zoles. Again. Yeah, watch out, the Fire Zoles here, they're Fire Zole Tribbles. So you need to kill the gels quick before they respawn back to Zoles again. So you kinda have to kill them quick. So yeah, the Zoles here are trickier. Won't be a problem later when we get the magic sword to kill him in one shot. And I forgot I had the wand so I can start spamming that. That way I don't waste arrows anymore. Okay, was there anything to the north here? Let me make sure. Alright, nothing. Passageway it is then. And after 5 is done, we're definitely going to call it an LP part. Ah, blue dark nuts. Oh, damn it. Oh, oh, crap. Oh, grrr. Son of a bitch. Getting too sloppy on these guys. Eh, I'm not gonna worry about it. I'll make back my lost energy. Come on. Yeah, I am really playing against these guys like garbage right now. Come on. Ugh. I should have executed a lot better in that room. Redemption time. Let's go. Ooh. Oh, come on. I should have hit him. Well, I made up for it a little bit. Yeah, not only got these guys to worry about, I got the fire souls. There we go. Now yeah, let me get the wand out, start zapping stuff. Alright, back to full. This blue dark nut, there we go. Don't have to worry about them anymore. Yay, key for our effort. And now we go up. I'll give those easy room here. Maybe we'll get the map in here, who knows. We haven't even got the compass yet. Oh, we got the compass! Yay! <laughs> Next! Well, I wonder if the dungeon item might be here. Or it'll probably be another passageway. I'm banking on the later. Alright, let's just start killing stuff with the wand. Yay, who oh, give me the money. And now we push the block. And it's a passage as I expected. What awaits up here? More blue dark nuts, blah. There we go. Maybe I'm finding my rhythm again. Come on. Yeah, now I'm owning you bitches like I should have been before. Maybe I'm just anxious to get through this place. Alright, all dead there. And we got more blue dark nuts. Uh, 
Ugh, great, they're all near the doorway. This is gonna be fun. Now we get rid of some of the red ones. Alright, we're narrowing it down in here a little bit. Alright, you get over here. And now the last blue one. Yay! Got another key. What's over here now? Alright, got Gibdos and Bull's Voice. Now we got arrows for the bunnies. We got bubbles in here too with them. Alright, they're dead. What's up here? Alright, I gotta kill these keys quick because they're gonna turn into fires. Uh, let's see if there's anything up here or. Oh, wait, I'm already at the top of the map. What am I doing? That was a waste of a bomb. Alright, more blue dark nuts. Whoa. I avoided damage somehow on that exchange. Oh, get over here. Fairy. Though. Thought I had him dead there. Okay, man. Whoa, whoa, crud. Get out of here. Kind of blindsided me with those poles voice. Alright, after wiping out the bunnies, now we come in here. Oh, got blue flames. Well, you got rivers of blood here, so you can camp out here and avoid the dark nuts. And you don't have to worry about the blue flames reaching you either, as they can't go over the river of blood. Doesn't matter how many times you split them. And now we go up. I think this is going to be the item room here. Boy, I would hope it's not another item passage. Yeah, let me just spam the wand. Die, fire souls! Hey! Alright, now let's go in here. Oh man, another passage! Oi, where's this damn dungeon item? And another blue dark nut room. Give me something new already! Boy, thank god I became a somewhat pro fighter with these dark nuts. There's a bazillion of them in this place. Okay, let's go up here. Alright, looks like that locked door at the beginning is going to lead us to our dungeon item. Just found our way to the boss again. But hey, at least we're gonna get five done in this part still. Yeah, we'll hopefully get six done in the next part. 
From here on out, it's probably gonna be one dungeon per video. And we got a Gleok here, okay. Well, this time a four-headed Gleok with statue support. But if you have the White Sword, it's still nothing, really. Just tank it and kill it. I got enough hearts, it really doesn't matter. Yay. And now our fifth Triforce piece. Level 5 is done, folks. Woot! Now I just gotta run right back in here and get the dungeon item real fast. Hello, level 5. I'm back again. I want my dungeon item. Well, we hear a boss sound. And it's a dead end. Hmm. I wonder what I must do. Now we get the map. And as you can see, there's one room we haven't checked out yet. Walk through it! Hello, Dick Dogger. And hello, Recorder in the middle of the room. Now we use the newfound recorder to kill the Dig Dogger. So Dig Dogger's pretty much a doormat for the dungeon item. That's quite a downgrade for our fellow eyeball. But then again, Dig Dogger was never really a massive threat to start with. Okay, level 5 is now truly done. Yeah, I'll just ignore the moblins for now. I'm gonna kill them on this screen, and then I'm gonna call it an LP part. Well, we got quite a bit done today. I is happy. Alrighty, folks, I'm gonna end things here, so stay tuned for Let's Play Legend of Zelda BTJ Craft's 5th Quest for Zelda Classic Part 4, when we'll attempt level 6. And I'm hoping I might be able to find another heart container so we get the magic sword before going into 6. And we'll see if we get our 6 Triforce piece. And maybe get the blue map so we get a potion as well, because we need it for those darn whiz robes. Anyways, see you then, peoples!